Welcome back to Wonderlist August episode 3. I can't believe how fast this is going. This is already the third episode. Sorry for how long the last ones have been. They've just been longer videos. So today is a little bit shorter and today I thought I would share with you guys what's on my desk. So when you guys see me filming I'm going to show you what I'm actually looking at. But first I want to share with you guys what is on my face. So I'm wearing the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, Bare Minerals Blush in Golden Gate, and this is a winter or fall blush, but I really wanted to wear it today. I have on Urban Decay's Eyeshadow Primer Potion, and then on my eyes, I decided to give my Naked Basics palette a break, and I'm wearing the Maybelline Quad in Chai Latte, and this has very similar colors. So I filled in my eyebrows with the crease color, and then on my lid, I have the base, which is that lightest color. Then I put a little bit of the crease color in my eyes. Then on my waterline, I lined it with this Maybelline Color Tattoo in the teal color. And whenever you wear blue eyeshadow or eyeliner, it really makes your eyes look a lot whiter. And I have blue eyes, so it's even making my eyes look more blue. And I just did that with an angled brush. I also put a little bit of that crease color on my uh, lower lash line, too. And I have the Maybelline Illegal Lengths Mascara. This is a really lengthening mascara. And then finally on my lips, I have the Revlon Lip Butter in Tutti Fruity. And this is a really pretty orange color. I love this orange lip product because I can wear my orange, but it's not in your face orange. So it's a more sheer kind of orange. So this is what my desk looks like when you're just looking at it. So I have my lights and then usually my camera is on that tripod. And then I'm either sitting on a bouncy ball or my chair most of the time. So starting out, I obviously have my phone, and then I have a couple magazines here. This one I've really been enjoying, and then I have my favorite lotion. This is Lush's Lovely Jubblies, and it says it's a breast cream, but I just like to use it as a hand cream. It's supposed to be a firming lotion, but I just love the way it smells, and it's really good for your skin. So moving on, I have this tray that I got from Goodwill, actually. I just thought it was really cute, and it kind of is a little bit vintage looking so I have the tray and then this is a perfume that came in a bunch from Sephora. I have some sunglasses. These are my hair cutting scissors. My more expensive ones so I keep them there. And then this is the Viva La Juicy perfume from Juicy Couture and I love this for summer because it's a very sweet scent but what I don't love about it is it doesn't last very long. It only lasts like four hours or so but I still love it. And then I have this little container that we found thrifting, but in it I put this feather that I actually found while walking on my driveway. It's an owl feather, and we hear the owl every night. It's really cute. It goes cuckoo, cuckoo. So I thought that was kind of cute. It looks like it's a pen ink thing, but it's actually not. Then over here I have the swan thing, and this is actually from Goodwill too. It was actually not painted gold, I just bought it how it was, and then I spray painted it this metallic gold. So, I really, really love that. And then obviously I have my lights, my two big lights over here. Those are nothing special, just really bright, and I have to have them on right now or else you guys can't see. Moving on from the tray, I have my tripod, and this was actually found thrifting too. Actually, my grandma and my aunt bought it for me. Thank you guys. And it was only $15, but that's probably like a $50 tripod, so it's a really, really nice tripod, and I love it. And usually my table would be against the wall, but since I'm filming every other day this month, I decided I would just permanently move it out. There I am. Hello. <laughs> but this is a mirror that I use. Obviously, you need a mirror to do your makeup. So this is my mirror. Then over here, I have two glass jars that I also bought from Goodwill. And this one, I just put a bunch of pencils in. I think it looks really cute. And then that one has ornaments in it. Then I have a very small window, and I had to tape it because there's a hole in it, and if I don't tape it, spiders will come through. So I do not want that. Then this is a candle holder. Um, I don't ever light the candle, it's just for looks. And then this is the main event. On this glass tray, I like to keep um, my current makeup that I'm trying to use or makeup that I just want to use up. And basically, I'll run you through this quickly. Right here, I have a little glass tray that I keep most of my eye stuff in. So I have a lot of the color tattoos. I love those. A L'Oreal eyeshadow, um, a sampler right there. This I really love. This palette, it's a Sigma thing that I got as a sample for buying brushes. 
and it's some of their colors and I really really love all of the colors in there. A bunch of eye stuff, eyelash curler, the mascara that I used today, eyeliner, eyebrow stuff, good stuff. Then I have the Chanel Mademoiselle perfume that I wear on special occasions only because I love it so much. And my all nighter setting spray, love this makeup setting spray. My face brushes and then my eye brushes are right there. A makeup sponge, this isn't the beauty blender, this is actually from Walmart but I love it just as much. And then I have all of my like concealers and foundations that I'm trying to use up. If you watched my last video, you know my favorite ones are right here. And this is actually a primer that I really love. I like to use it on the top of my cheekbones. That was in my Lush video. My Naked Basics palette, can't live without that. I love it to death. Rimmel Stay Matte, best powder ever. Chanel bronzer that I can't really use because I'm too pale for it. I love it, it just goes orange on me so quickly, so that's kind of a bummer. Um, some blushes, favorite blushes, all time favorite blush ever. A lip conditioner, the lip product I'm wearing right now. Here is some hand sanitizer, need that. These are both Physicians Formula, bronzers, two cream blushes. Then underneath it, what I did was I put um, just some magazine stuff, so I'm going to clear this off really fast. So I cut out this page from a magazine. This is actually a Madewell magazine, and I just love all the colors, and I think it's really cute. And then I have this picture of my boyfriend when he was a baby. I just think it's so cute. Adam, you're so cute. And then I have a Lush um, bag, which I just really love Lush, so I think that's cute right there. So I just put glass over it, and I really like how it looks, and it keeps my makeup more organized and separate from the rest of my desk. So I want to show you guys something really quickly. It's this website called Rue La La, and I'm sure you guys have heard of it because they have commercials everywhere now, but I have been shopping Rue La La for probably two years now, and I just absolutely love it. So it's a flash sale site. They have things go on sale um, every single day at 11 o'clock. It's up to like 80% off and everything's authentic and real and I, I just absolutely love this website. So when you buy something, you spend $10 in shipping but then you get 30 days of free shipping. So I have four days left of free shipping and here's just some of the things that they have on sale. So if you don't know from watching my last video, but I'm actually running a marathon in October so I need some running sunglasses. So I saw today that Oakley was on sale and I was kind of going through what they had and I found these sunglasses and here was the discount. It was originally $130 and brought down to $50. So I thought I'd buy them. They're really good. Um, they're purple and cute and I really like them. That's it for today's video. Hope you guys kind of enjoyed this vlog style. Now I'm going to edit it and post it and you guys will have another video in two days. And I'm also going to paint my nails. What color should I paint my nails? Out of these three, I'm really feeling either this one or this one. I don't know which one to do. But um, a little tip, this is my favorite nail strengthening um, base coat. It's by OPI. It's called Nail Envy. It's seriously amazing. And then I always apply my cuticle cream after. Or actually, this is a cuticle oil. But what color should I paint my nails, guys? I don't know. I think I'm going to do this one. I love this color. It's Fuji. Essie's Fuji. Best nail polish ever. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on Wednesday with another new video. Bye-bye.